Hey everybody, Robo Ninja Potipus here, and let's get ready to play The Legend of Zelda, the Minish Cap. Oh yeah, baby. What the heck's wrong with what the heck's wrong with you, Dakota, huh? What the what the heck's wrong with you? You said you were gonna play the Legend of Zelda. That's right everybody, I did say I'd play the Legend of Zelda, but I never said which one, because I'm evil that way. Anyway, uh I'm just gonna name myself uh RNP. Yeah, I know that sounds kinda cliche, but it's the only thing I could think of, so here we go. Let's get started, everybody. A long, long time ago, when the world was on the verge of being swallowed by Shadow, the Hedgehog. The tiny Picoria appeared from the sky, bringing the hero of men a sword and a golden knight. With wisdom and courage, the hero drove out the darkness. When peace had been restored, the people enshrined that played with care. Da, 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 da. Oh, there's Princess Zelda. She looks different in every game. Wow. Dun, dun. Dun, dun. Yeah, I played this game for about three years. It's a really awesome game, everybody. Duh, duh. Duh, duh. Good morning, Master Smith. Goodness me, Princess Zelda. Did you sneak out of the castle and come all this way alone? The minister is sure to be worried about you. You know how he gets. Oh, don't worry about him. He'll be fine. Where's RNP? The whole town is bustling for the annual Picori Festival. I thought he and I might go together. Would you mind terribly? Oh, is that what you're here for? Well, RNP was up late helping me last night, and he's still asleep. But I do have an errand at the castle. Yes, that should be fine. RNP, time to get up! R.N.P. Time to get up. Huh? Huh? What? What? What the hell is that? Ah! Ah! Oh my God! I just had a horrible nightmare. I dreamt I was like some kind of weird midget elf guy. I don't know. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, oh my God! That was horrible. Okay, what does he want? Huh? What are you doing here? Hey! Hey! R.N.P. Princess Zelda is here. She'd like to know if you'd join her at the festival. Yeah, sure. Yeah, RNP, come on. Let's go and check out the festival together. Master Smith already gave me permission to take you because he loves kidnapping. Yes, after all, the festival only comes once a year. Go on, have fun. And while you're there, you can do me a favor. I just finished making this sword for the minister at Hyrule Castle. I'd like you to deliver it to him. Awesome. You accepted the smith sword. Make sure you don't lose this extremely important delivery. This is the blade that will be presented to the winner of the competition. Don't lose it. And while the two of you may be childhood friends, remember, Zelda is the princess of Hyrule. Don't try anything funny. You watch over her. Don't let anything bad happen to her. Master Smith, quit worrying. We'll be perfectly safe. Come on, RMP. Let's go check out the festival. Yeah, sure, okay. Zelda is the princess of Hyrule. You watch over her. Don't let anything bad happen to her. Don't worry. I promise. You got 20 rupees. That's great. South Park. Yay. Hey! RMP! Over here! Sure. Let's go, people. Let's go! RMP! Hurry! Let's go! Oh, I'm coming. Over here! Come on! Hurry up! What does she want? She's so crazy today. Well, here we are, the town of Hyrule. That's right, everybody. We're going to the one and only town where every great Zelda game starts. Here we are, RNP. Doesn't it look fun? You bet your butt it looks fun. You bet your butt. 
Come on, let's look around. That's right, everybody. Welcome to Hyrule. New expectations. Fire in our eyes. Nothing's gonna stand in our way. Not tonight. Oh my god, god this, that line is so awesome. I can't even begin to... My voice doesn't even do that line justice. As a matter of fact, let's hear it right now. Nothing's gonna stand in our way. Not tonight. Awesome. Awesome. That line was just awesome. I can't even begin to tell you how awesome that line was. Alright, well anyways, let's move along. Hey, guy, have you ever seen the Picori? I saw one just the other day. No, I never saw a Picori. It wore a red cone-shaped hat, and it was really small. I think it's called a gnome. And it was standing inside my dad's shoe. I really saw it, I swear. Oh, wow, that's got to be awkward. I've never seen the Picori before. Only once every hundred years does the mystic doorway open. This is the door that links the human world to the, to the world of the Picori. When this door opens, the Picori can enter our world. And guess what? This marks the hundredth year since they last appeared here. Seriously? Oh my god! I'm sure something wonderful is going to happen at this festival. I'm just on my way back from seeing the tournament at Hyrule Castle. Let me tell you, watching all those sword fights made me hungry. Ooh, veggies. Phew! Preparing for the festival left me absolutely exhausted. Need a sensu bean? Still, I'm enjoying watching people have fun. So am I. So am I, man. This is so awesome. R&P, there's a storyteller here. We should stop and listen to... Oh, I wonder what's over there. Yay for ADHD. So the Picori are real. My father always told me they were. Oh, look at that. Yay for more ADHD. Say, wasn't there going to be a sword fighting tournament at the castle? I wonder who won this year. Oh, wow, over there. Yeah, I'm sorry about that, dude. I just can't control her. Well, not that that's a good thing, but anyways. You're the boy from Old Master Smith's place, right? I'm sure you know this, but he's the best swordsmith Hyrule has ever seen. Sweet. Last year, I entered the tournament trying to win that sword of his. I haven't won yet, and maybe I never will, but that tournament was awesome. The winner this year was a new face. I've been wondering where he's from. Maybe from evil. Spoilers! Just kidding. Or maybe not. He used some incredible techniques and won the whole tourney in record time. Well, what do we have here? We have a winner! Oh my, Princess Zelda, you won the grand prize in our drawing? Wow! You get your choice of any of these wonderful prizes. What will it be? First, we have this lovely heart-shaped stone. Next, we have this magnificent gem. And finally, there's this teeny tiny shield. So, which one would you like? Let me guess, the jewel? Oh, but this heart stone is very cute, too. Choose whichever one you like. The shield is so adorable. I think I'll take it. What? You've got to be kidding me. Why? Why would you want that ugly thing? What about the heart-shaped stone? It's cute. Or this giant gem? It's pretty. Honestly, they're both much nicer than that nasty little shield thing. Nope. I want the shield. Can I have it? What a strange princess you are. Well, okay, here's your teeny tiny shield. Ah! What do you want? Here, I want to give you a present. Oh, okay. Doesn't the shield see you perfectly, RMP? I don't know, it's kind of small. Princess Zelda gave you a small shield. Hold the button to protect yourself. It is a little embarrassing, though. It's so tiny. Oh my god. The thing is tiny. I'll never be able to do anything with this. Yep, just as I thought. You look great. Now, if anything happens, you can protect me with that shield. <laughs> I'm so sure. I'm so sure. Oh, I almost forgot. We have to take Master Smith's sword to the castle. Let's go, RMP. Yeah, sure, why not? Look at that bell, that's so beautiful. I've never seen the Picori before. Hmm. Neither have I, yet. And neither have you guys, yet. Unless you played this game like I have, and beaten it twice, because I like bragging that way, because I'm evil. Come on, RMP, let's hurry to the castle. Well, I'm sorry, Princess Zelda, but we can't hurry at all because it's time to end the episode. That's right. Cliffhanger! Ha ha! Pfft. 
Well, anyways, thank you guys for watching so much, and I'm really hoping this is going to be a great Let's Play, and uh, I want to thank you guys for being so supportive of me in my last Let's Play and just watching all of this, and uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. This has been Robot Ninja Platypus, and uh, I'll see you tomorrow.